try any pears recipe on fried gnocchi with peas. Make for and chili because we haven't got any peas, so I'm just going to do it without. And maybe a side salad and maybe some mozzarella so it looks better. So I'm going to switch it up a bit. Got some gnocchi, some lettuce, some mint, buffalo mozzarella, chili. Got water as well, and I've got some sourdough for sales. Do something with that, so let's let's see. Washed our lettuce, so we're gonna fan that for our salad. And Hi, Kelsey's doing you our keep it, yeah, she's chopped up our uh, mint leaves. Mind your fingers, Persia. That's it, good girl. Okay, then we're gonna chop a little bit of chili as well. I don't want a bit green. So, what's this cheese called, Persia? Santa Mozzarella. <laughs> to make some croutons, aren't we, Persia? And then we're going to pop them in the Help. oven to make them nice and crispy. Yeah, this one's a bit hard, isn't it? Um, mixing up the balsamic vinegar and olive oil for our bread. For our bread. We've done fried the gnocchi and we're mixing it with cheese. You can add more cheese to it, Persia. Add more cheese because it will go it will go nice and gooey. Yeah. And then we've also got some mint. Add, add some mint to there. Lots of mint. No, just like handful. Go a little bit at a time, a little bit at a time. Just to, yeah, go a little bit at a time. That's it. I think that's alright. Give it a sprinkle in. There you go. And you can add more cheese. Oh, there's cheese, add more cheese. Can never have enough cheese. Cheese is too good. When that's all mixed up, we're going to start plating it up. Okay, so that's it. Voila, we're done. Looks really good. Can't wait to taste it. We've got our 